A mink, a fink, a skating rink. What is a noun? Written by Brian P. Cleary. Illustrated by Jenya Prozminski. Hill is a noun. Mill is a noun. Even Uncle Phil is a noun. Gown is a noun. Crown is a noun. In fact, our whole hometown is a noun. If it's a deck, a duck, or deer, if it's a crystal chandelier, if it's a train or brain or frown, it's elementary. It's a noun. Nouns can sometimes be quite proper, like Brooklyn Bridge or Edward Hopper, London Levi's Pekingese. Proper nouns name all of these. A jail, a nail, a bale of hay, the pool or park in which you play, a quarter, a porter, a pencil or pair. Nouns are seen most everywhere. A box, a lip, a chocolate chip, a cup or glass from which you sip, a pocket, button, sleeve or cuff. A noun can simply be your stuff. A mink, a fink, a skating rink, a cake, a rake, your kitchen sink, the Pope, some soap that's on a rope, a downtown mall, a downhill slope. A house, a mouse, a broken clock, New Mexico, an old white sock, some tar, a bar, a baseball star, the place where mother parks her car. A noun can be your Auntie Lynn, the mayor of the town you're in, your friend who tells you corny jokes. A noun can be your favorite folks. A collar, a scholar. A handful of sand, saxes and faxes, the brass in the band, a cat, a bat, your grandma's hat. Nouns are a little of this and that. If it's a place of any kind, a mountain, hall, or highway nine, if it's a country, state, or town, then surely, surely, it's a noun. And so is a poodle. Cherry strudel, a fork, a cork, a curly noodle, a king, a queen, some gasoline, a red raspberry ice machine. If it's a person, place, or thing, your dad, Detroit, a diamond ring. If it's a boat, or coat, or clown, it's simple, Simon. It's a noun. So, what is a noun? Do you know? The end. This read aloud has been brought to you by Time to Read to Us. Hit the subscribe button for more kid-friendly read alouds. Thanks for watching.